Hey guys, TKF13 here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. <sighs> it's finally time to take on the sixth gym. And I remember this mechanic from uh, good, good old, good old Gen 1. Oh boy, this, this isn't going to be too fun, is it? Blindly stumbling my way around. It's just like Silph Cow. Psychics look weird in this game. Slow, bro. Might be a mistake leading with Sting, but I want to try. Because Sting does have Twin Needle. That is super effective. That was crit? Oh, well, yeah, Slow, bro is super tanky. Yeah. Okay, Sting's dead. Or apparently not. Uh, now let's see what happens. I, I don't think this is going to kill. Oh, no it did. Alright then. Surprisingly that worked. Kadabra. I think Sting should be faster. Yup. Yeah, and Kadabra has no... Yeah, no defense. So that works. I could go in with Burrow, too, and just try to sucker punch everything. That might work. Well, for now, let's just heal. Uh, let's try this one. And that just takes us back over here. Well, it seems like the teleportation puzzle is at least a little easier. Uh, now we have four options. Chandler. Haunter. That doesn't help me. I guess that's gonna use Psychic. Yeah, just going to Moonbeam. Oh, we're just gonna go for Confuse, right? Huh. I swear, Moonbeam. Don't, don't, don't hurt yourself in confusion. That's exactly what's gonna happen, though. Shadow Ball. Cool. Special defense dropped, and hit myself. Right? No, that's surprising. Another Haunter. Right, I realized I could go into Burrow and use Earthquake. Cool Sucker Punch. Good shit, Moonbeam. Actually doing pretty well. I shouldn't say that. I'm just jinxing myself now, aren't I? No. That's unfortunate. Alright. 
Ace Trainer Amanda. Oh, great, Jinx. God. Twin Needle should be pretty effective. Yup. Crit. Yeah, way, way to go, Sting. What a good boy. <laughs> and that was it. Alright then. Uh, could it possibly be this one, or is it just take me back up? No, it took me up. Where does this take me? Over here. Cameron. Whoa, that's a dead Kadabra. <laughs> I don't know. M you know, may maybe I was overthinking this. Maybe Sting can do this. I don't think Sabrina has a slow bro. Jesus Christ. You know, and if Sting keeps doing that, I really don't think we have anything to worry about. Yeah, let's just kill a bunch of Kadabras. Now she was almost at level 50. That's good. Uh, try going diagonal. Takes me to another psychic. Preston. Hit now. Eh, Twin needle shit. Twin Needle should still kill it. Or not. Oh, 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 no, that's not good. That's not great. Alright, Shio's turn. Watch things like a Dream Eater. Yeah, there it is. Full heals. Uh, let's try this one. Alright. I have a feeling I'm headed in the right direction. Let me just burrow in this one. Mari. Yeah, she, she, she's just gonna have three haunters, isn't she? Cool sucker punch. They're just all gonna sucker punch me, aren't they?
Yep, three haunters. Great team. I know it's hard making a team out of just Kanto Pokemon, but you shouldn't just use the same Kanto Pokemon three times. Should be the last of the trainers. That's not right. That's even worse. You know, I don't, I don't know what's stopping me from not just going right back onto the teleporter I tried last time. That just seems so much easier, John. Wait, what? Is that the one I already used? I thought I used the one that was up here. I did, what the fuck? Do I need to use this one over here? Thank god. Alright, that pain is over. Now it's time for a new pain. Not quite a phantom pain, because it's not a, uh, not a ghost type gem. So I can't quite make that joke, but oh well. It'll have to do for now. So you've come. I had a, I had a vision of your arrival. I have had psychic power since I was a child. It started when I carelessly threw a spoon aside and it bent itself into an unnatural shape. I dislike battling, but if you wish to, then I will show you my power. Mr. Mime. Actually, I'm thinking about it here. Does fair does does psychic resist poison? Guess we'll find out. Nope. Nice. Die, mime. Oh, you do have a slow, bro. That's cool. Uh, you know what I have? I I have moonbeam. No, it's a, it's a real good thing I gave Moonbeam Thunderbolt. <laughs> I want to try something first. Let me try using Sing. Yeah, Moonbeam! I can't believe that actually worked. Oh well, makes this a little easier. Two other Pokemon after this, I think. Again, like I say many times, I, part of my screen's cut off because my. I don't know why the resolution. Like, something's weird, my TV's resolution. Jinx. Alright, back out to Sting then.
And there it is, Alakazam. Alright, let's go to a needle. Do we have- Oh no, we don't have speed. Ooh, this- uh... Oh, sting. Barely living. And killing. Oh. Nice. Not not a single loss. Came close. But Sting is a god. This loss shocks me. But a loss is a loss. I admit I didn't work hard enough to win. It's a ring she has on her fingers. I wonder what those were. Your victories earned you a marsh badge. Yeah, we did it, Shio. A marsh badge raises the level of Pokemon that will obey you to level 70 for Pokemon that you've received from another trainer. And wait, please take this TM with you. Calm Mind. TM33 is Calm Mind. It makes Pokemon concentrate to bo boost both its special attack and special defense in battle. Psychic power isn't something that only a few people have. Everyone has psychic power. People just don't realize it. Yeah, we, we did good, Shio. I honestly thought Shio was going to play a bigger part in this battle. But nah, it, it was really just Sting that won the day. I had to switch out to, uh, to Moonbeam for a little bit, but... Yeah, St Sting carried this fucking fight. I honestly didn't think he would. Oh, that's been a while since I fed you. Alright. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Let's see, we're at 18 minutes. Uh. I guess we'll see what happens. Alright, so we got our marsh bit. Hmm. I know next we have to go to Cinnabar Island. I'm trying to think how that works in this game, because we don't have surf yet. Let me try going over to Fuchsia, because maybe I missed something in- Oh! Gotta stop doing that, Shio. Thinking maybe I missed something in a uh, fuchsia. We are drawing much closer to the end of the game now. Two gyms left. Oh right, I should probably heal up first. down on the beach last time, did we? Starmie. Oh cool, another psychic type. I forget what Starmie's defenses are like though. 
So, uh, well, I mean, 10 levels. Yeah, we're fine. I wonder, if I was to say, let's put arms away for now. Ah, you can't fly it out of the water. That's dumb. Alright, there's arms. Alright. Oh, well, I guess now I gotta figure out how to get this fucking uh, surf move. Oh, Dratini! Oh, that's a good thing I have Outrage. So I, I I just missed I just missed Surf when I was in Fuchsia. God damn it! How dumb can I actually fucking be? Uh, you see, John, this is why you need to talk to NPCs. Yeah, here we go. This Lapras is getting on in age, but it's still real beauty, wouldn't you say? We used to ride on waves and travel the whole wide world together. Lapras can't swim like it used to, so we'll stay here together. Thank you for listening. As thanks, I'll teach you the secret technique Sea Skim. With this technique, you can travel on water. <laughs> Your Eevee wants to learn it as well? I'm not sure if it can learn it. It's not water type. She's very motivated. You look determined, just like my Lapras. Okay, I'll teach you the technique then. Now you have to keep balance on the water. Lower, your, lower the center of gravity, keep balance up with your upper body. Aww. You did great! I'll give you that board too. Ride waves and travel the whole wide world together. Alright, we can use Sea Skim. Which means now a whole bunch of new shit's opened up to us. We could even go back and go to the power plant. Actually, you know, I don't even have to go to Seafoam Islands. I could just fly. Honestly, I could just fly back to Pallet Town and surf down to Cinnabar from there. It'd be a faster trip. Because, you know, the Seafoam Islands aren't even necessary. You know, quick experiment. Can I really do this? <laughs> Aww. 
Shio. Shio's mimicking Brock. That's precious. Yeah, I don't need to go to the Seafoam Islands. I should just be able to surf straight down from Pallet Town. Pokemon are in the grass. Aren't there Tangle in the grass over here? Just a bunch of rats. Tentacool. A star you. It's cool how Pokemon in the water appear. I don't know if I'll fight all these trainers right now. I might just do this off screen, honestly. If I need the levels, I'll grind. Well, actually, I don't even need to fight trainers to grind. There is a coach trainer here, though. Oh, that's a Tentacruel. Eh, I still hit it. There we go. <laughs> and I got tentacool candies from that, too. Hey, yeah, else cool in the water over here? Another Tentacruel Magikarp. A lot of Magikarps. I haven't gotten one of these guys yet, have I? Oops. I find it hard to believe I haven't gotten a Magikarp yet. Are you, are you gonna tell me that I'm gonna have more trouble trying to catch this fucking Magikarp than I did with the, uh... than I did with the Tentacruel? Cool! No, that was fun. Boy, I sure do like being emasculated by Magikarps. That's great. Because even the coach trainers ask if I'm going to Cinnabar Island. <laughs> See, you, even she knows this is the smarter way to go to Cinnabar. Everyone does. Why, why bother going all the way around through the Seafoam Islands when I don't need to? Oh, she's average, honestly. Yeah, the trainers are 44 over here. Oh, that's an ice punch. Oh, that's fine. Uh-oh. After two? Don't freeze me. You crit me, though. That I don't like. Sting might be dead. Nope. Those are the fucking jinxes. I don't know why I stayed in, I'm confused. Yeah! Sting's great though. That's why I stayed in. Ooh, more speed. 
<laughs> Look at those stats. Sting has not. Sting actually has a lot of special defense. I never noticed that until now. Hmm. Cool dizzy punch. Alright, let's see what Pam has to give us. <laughs> oh, ice punch. Huh. I mean, that's pretty good TM, if I'm being honest. Actually, another thing about it, are all the punches TMs in this game? Because we already have Thunder Punch. Yeah, dragons and grass types. And flying as well. Oh, I thought we were at Cinnabar already. Water stone. Probably sell all these like different stones I have that I don't need. Big star, you over there. PP up. I'm glad that I keep finding those. Oh, here we are. Oh, wow. An actual dock on Cinnabar. Wow, this place is something else. Just a Pokemon lab. Pretty small island. Just like it was in, uh, the originals. Now let's heal. I think we'll do a little exploration in the, uh, Pokemon lab here. Then I think we'll call it a day. Because we do have some Pokemon to get from the lab. Slack off room. Oh, hey. Isn't that the guy we found in Mount Moon? Because he was talking about how he found a fossil there. Oh, good job, dumbass. Oh, don't, don't say evolve to Eevee. Eevee doesn't want to change. <laughs> you giving me taunt? Alright then. Is that a, what, what is that? Okay then. Pipe. Alright then. I got taunt. Gee, thanks, Mom. Oh, here we go. This should be the guy. Yep, fossils. Yeah, here's the Helix fossil.
All right, we got an Omanyte. Aw. And we do have one more that we got from the museum in uh, Pewter City. Yep, Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl is objectively the coolest of the three fossil Pokemon in this game. And probably the best one, too. Aerodactyl's cool. I think they only, we only get them at, what, level 20, right? You know, I'm curious, this Venomoth I caught two episodes ago. It's quiet nature. Which is special attack increasing. Stun Spore. Oh, that's that's Gen 7 Leech Life, isn't it? Yeah. That's actually really good. Oh, if I didn't already have a full team, Venomoth would have been a you know, if I what if I wasn't using Beedrill, I would have used Venomoth. And I, I wouldn't even I wouldn't have even gone for a shiny Venomoth, because I just like the color Venomoth's color scheme. Purple. You know, I and I didn't check the fossil Pokemon. God damn it, I got too caught up in the Venomoth. Oh, level 44. Oh wow. Wow. Okay, that's a lot better than getting a level 20. Sassy. Special defense up for sp less speed. That's terrible. Rock Throw Agility, Crunch, and Rock Slide. Good moveset, though. And same thing with this one, Sassy. Oh, whoa! That one, I just... I didn't check IVs on the Aerodactyl. You know, Special Defense for Speed is actually pretty good on this little guy. Hydro Pump, Rock Slide, Protect, and Rock Throw. <sighs> okay, those are actually some pretty shit IVs for an Aerodactyl. More, less attack for more speed, which I suppose isn't terrible. Best, fantastic in attack, best in special defense. Hmm. This Tentacruel. Less special attack for more special defense. HP, special attack, and what do you need speed for, Snorlax? That's actually quite good as well. This Venomoth is actually quite good. It's not the best, but... Still a good-ass Venomoth. Alright, uh... Yeah, I guess that'll do it for this episode. In the next one, we're gonna go into the Pokemon Mansion and, uh... Have ourselves a look around. Because we gotta do that before we go into the gym. So, I will see you guys then. Bye! Oh, hold up. Nah, no, she's an antidote. Alright, see you guys later. Bye!